What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today we are going over um, some NBA 2K21 locker codes and whatnot. Um, let's just type that in. And then we're going to go over the market a little bit, man. Um, guys, if you guys are interested, we're going to start streaming MLB. Um, not on YouTube, though. We're going to start streaming it on Twitch if you guys are interested, man. It'd be appreciated if you could show the love. I get the game tomorrow because I have the game pass. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. I already started my team up. I dropped 50 bucks in stubs so far. Um, open up packs for the fun of it. The packs are so bad in that game. Anyways, let's get into it, man. If you need MT me up, I'm buying and selling MT. I have mega deals right now, guys. Like, absolute mega deals. So, hit me up. Uh, we're gonna remove that. Look at that, Corona Zen. I haven't used the Zen. I did it for VC glitches, but that's it, man. I ha The Zen's obviously patched now, but I literally got the Zen and I never even used it. So, I don't know. The Zen was a waste of money. Do not buy the Zen. It's literally... So, it's just not a good product, in my opinion. But anyways, here we go, guys. Um, here it is. KZM994. All this good stuff. These are all the lock codes that are active. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So, you can pause the screen. Um, you can pause the screen, look those up. And then you can pause the screen and look these up. So there you go. Those are the codes. And now let's get into some market. I'm going to spit some nonsense, spit my market talk and see what's going on with the market. So let's see, man. We have a pretty good amount of MT. We have about a million MT. Uh, let's see what we got. So uh, let's go over to Dark Matters first, see if it's a good time to sell and or buy. I'm trying to make this video nice and short. Um, so first off, I've seen the community. Actually, a lot of people are quitting this game right now. And it's because of the fact that online is so trash guys online is really just not it right now um i do not enjoy online not only that the rewards are so bad like honestly guys this game right now is pay to win if you're not grinding jr smith if you don't have the time to grind jr smith because this is a huge grind i'm not grinding jr smith i i just don't have fun with this game as of lately i literally just been going on making my investments and getting off that's the only thing i've been enjoying so let me know in the comments what do you think exactly how this game has been planning out how the game could be perf how could the game could be be better i'm starting right now because right now the game is just not fun in my opinion i'm just not having fun whatsoever with this game i think the gameplay is straight trash but i want to hear what you guys think anyways dark matter i think the one card i've been looking at is chris bosh um he's a beast He's just, I love Chris Bosh either way. Um, Chris Bosh is one of my favorite centers of all time, power forward centers of all time. I love Chris Bosh, always love Dinosaur. So honestly, is it a good day to sell? In my opinion, it's a good day to sell. Today is Monday. It's a very, very good day to sell. And here's why. Um, there is no super packs out. The packs that are out right now aren't good. But I'm hearing that there's going to be fan favorites this week, which means some of these cards could crash. Um, but yeah, right now, I would definitely recommend selling some dark matters if you have them. It's not a good time to sell your investments. It really isn't. Right now, the market's up pretty good. Giannis is another one. Another card that has rose up a ton. Um, these cards just continuously rise up in value, and it's definitely a great time to sell. All right, so now we're going to go over snipe filters, man. Like I said, there's not a lot of snipe filters. These snipe filters are kind of killed unless you're doing the enabled filter. Um, so looking at the pink diamond filter, look at this. Manu Ginobili is cheap, I guess because he was in that locker code. Um, they're giving away a free pink diamond that is not usable. This car was literally out day one, I think, or like couple, literally like one of the first cards to come out in the first weeks. Um, so if you want to invest in him, it's probably a very bad idea unless you get him for dirt, dirt cheap. Um, I think they gave this card away for free. So 5k, honestly, this filter might not be bad. You could probably snag some for around 3 to 4k. Um, if you do do that, you probably sell them for 4,900. This filter might not be bad. Also, there could be other pink diamonds on this filter. So definitely try it out. You may hit, it's a hit or miss. It's a hit or miss. So now let's go to diamonds. Like I said, man, the NBA 21 diamond cards like AD, LeBron, KD, Harden, Kawhi, they have absolutely destroyed this filter. So if you want, you could stay on this filter. Maybe you get a diamond that's usable other than the NBA 21s. You can make some MT. But as of right now, man, this filter is just not it. It's just really not it. And also, guys, 
I got my HGA submission back. If you guys are into sports cards, check that out after this video on my second channel. And also, if you guys could please follow the TikTok, that would be appreciated. Um, and the Instagram and the Twitter, all that good stuff. We're on pretty much every social media, and we're going to start up Twitch soon. So go follow the Twitch. We'll probably be streaming tonight at midnight, possibly, or tomorrow. I'm um, going to be playing a lot of online ranked seasons because, as you guys know, baseball is my favorite sport. Basketball is probably my second favorite sport. I don't know. Actually, basketball, football, baseball are probably my favorite sports, period. Uh, I can't really choose between anyone, but baseball, I did play my whole life, so I am very big into baseball, and I know everything about baseball. But here we go, man. Amethyst, looking at the Amethyst, um, 1,200. So Amethyst is pretty interesting. Um, I did snag a couple Amethysts the other day for around 900 MT. I don't know why people will put it up for cheaper than Quick Sell, but I picked them up for 900, sold them for 1,000. 100 MT profit, not a lot. It does add up, but like I said, investments are key. You have to know who to invest in. Any NBA 21 players in the collection are not the players you want to invest in. Kyrie, Luka, Embiid, Jimmy Butler, Jokic, you don't want to invest in them. They're just not it. You don't want to invest in players that have no profit margin. These cards have no profit margin. They will never go up because they're pullable in every single pack there is. Um, so try to stay away from these cards. You just want to invest in any other Amethyst other than them, other than double take cards. Double take cards are the cards you don't want to invest in or any cards that are in the triple threat offline board or the online board. Um, so yeah, definitely pay attention to this filter. It just sucks how the NBA 21 cards are so easy to get now. They're super, super, super um, non-common. Um, I mean, they're super common, I meant to say. So put your filter to 1200, try it out. Let me know how it goes. Next up, we're going over Galaxy Oval filter and it's gonna be the cheapest filter in the game. And like I said, if you want to sell your cards to make MT, go ahead. Listen, this Deron Williams at a 98 is actually a pretty good card. His defense is pretty decent as well. I think he's pretty good. Um, this card could go up in value depending on what you get him for. But then again, Super Packs are probably coming tomorrow because it is the end, almost the end of the season. We have about two weeks, two and a half weeks left. Um, there should be implementing Super Packs in the game probably tomorrow and then fan favorite soon. But that Deron Williams for 39k is looking like a steal. Um, I'm definitely a fan of this Deron Williams card. He's definitely interesting. Pay attention to this filter. Galaxy Oval Cheapest, you never know what's going to happen. Galaxy Oval Cheapest filter is definitely interesting. You should definitely make MT on it. But, yo, other than that, that's all we really got for the vid. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully, those locker codes help you out. And, yeah, other than that, man, I don't know, man. I haven't really been enjoying this game. Let me know if you guys have been enjoying this game. Right now, it's literally I just go on, I invest, and I get off. That's the only thing that I find fun. Um, the gameplay is so bad. It gets me so angry. It makes me want to throw my remote through a wall, through 10 walls um because I, I this game is getting me really pissed as of late that's why i haven't been streaming that's why i've been only posting one video per day i just can't play this game it's not exciting anymore the gameplay sucks the only thing i enjoy like i said is sniping but yo other than that that's all we got for the vid let me know what you guys think in the comments have a good one boys peace